Hello, my name is Edmund Jadu, and this is my home office. Owning my own business, I primarily work from home. I really needed a space that was not only reconfigurable for multiple purposes, but a space that allowed me to be creative, efficient, and productive. The office actually began life as a home bar that we built over the course of a summer. Uh, it was a concrete countertop and old cabinets that I had around the house. So I was able to reconfigure this area, remove some of the bar accessories, and really build out a nice productive space. I started by having a central focus point of these vertical shelves, these two foot black shelves. I really wanted this space to be an area where I could show my collectibles and some of the things I've had from my childhood that I think bring not only visual interest to the space, but kind of show a bit of my personality. I want this area to be a multi-purpose space between podcasts, YouTube, and just home office work in general. So I really wanted something in the background to give visual interest. So while rebuilding the space, I didn't want to eliminate all the personality that the bar originally had. Uh, I really liked the Jameson barrels that hang on the wall and even the Jägermeister machine. I thought it added a nice bit of character to the space. I really wanted the focal point of this desk to have this pivoting arm monitor. This 27 inch curved display would actually swing out of the way, uh, enabling you to reconfigure the space from productive office desk area into a kind of podcast studio. So I purchased a couple of these blue USB microphones on some pivoting arms as well and located them kind of out of the way and you can stretch them out when needed. I purchased the Samsonite office chair to replace an Ikea one I've had for years. All right, so the large theme in this build was reconfigurability. I really wanted a space that can go from the standard office setup to a more traditional podcast setup. This was achieved through the display swinging arm. Uh, this thing allows the display to get out of the way comfortably while still being efficient, productive, and useful. As you can see, you can extend the microphone arms out it's a perfect situation for recording podcasts, recording audio, or just having more desk space in general. I really like how this turned out, and this is probably my favorite part of the build. Moving on to the accent lighting, I also wanted the space to be more interesting on film. So for podcasts or general YouTube videos, I added some accent lighting from Amazon. These are simple stage lights attached to a light controller. I'll link all these below if you'd like to take a look at them. And what's a Jaeger tap machine without a mini fridge full of Red Bulls? Just like that, that's the Home Office Build 2019. Thank you all for watching, and I hope you took something away from it. Take care.